Hi. Hi. <laughs> oh, hold on. He didn't like how that sounded. Is it Is better? It, everything Is it good? What, what are you, why are you way Is up good? here? Uh, Hi. Hello. Howdy. And welcome. Oh. Oh, sorry. Take take well, two. Hey, what? <laughs> he wanted guess, it farther away from I you. Yes, I was too close. No, nobody wants to hear your shit. <laughs> Can we start now, Bubba? Hi. Hello. Howdy. Welcome back to Talking with Kitties. That's Bosco. That's girlfriend. And <laughs> that's boyfriend. And uh, I think somebody missed me. I think somebody missed him. I had my cuddle session earlier this morning. With this with guy. With coffee, so... Yeah. And, now it's your cuddle session time. And surprisingly, there was a there was a bit of a fitting in cuddle session. Yeah, it was so cute. Insert picture here. I was not was not expecting anything like that from him. No, I was a little sad that I didn't get some cuddles with him, but I got some serious good cuddles with Pusser this morning. Not like this though. He doesn't what lay on me. Doing? When he cuddles with me, he lays off to my side and he needs my hip. And he just gets head scratches and snuggles, and we're both happy and content. He's just flopping but and flailing today. When I get cuddles from kitties, I just get like side cuddles. No one actually like lays on me, mm -hmm. but you get all of the laying on and. I got some of snuggles. this yesterday from Gizzard too, because I was still wearing shorts. She didn't I was care. not under the blanket. She's like, no, right here. Yep. So yes, kitty cuddles. I think we were we were a little bit missed. I think maybe a little bit. Wish I could say the same. Oh, we missed them and you know it. <laughs> we made all kinds of promises about TikToks and videos and pictures and we were gonna try to vlog and we were gonna and we 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 took naps. Yeah. Yep, yep. Like ninety eight percent of our vacation that's, was that's a little much. I wouldn't say ninety eight. It was quite a bit. Eighty? Say sixty. Sixty percent we did lots of, sleeping. of our vacation was us sleeping and it was magical phenomenal magical best vacation ever it was a pretty it was a really nice vacation i just feel just bad because relaxing. we didn't we don't typically do anything for you sorry we don't typically go on vacation to do stuff like a lot of people do because a lot of people are like oh we're gonna do this we're gonna do that we're gonna do this we're gonna do that we go to vacation to relax yes yeah so for hard sure. And we certainly did. Mm -hmm. We did have an outing where we went um, miniature golfing mm -hmm. and go kart riding. Go kart riding. That was fun. That was and, a good adventure. Uh, fancy eats. We did eat at a couple fancy places that were pretty good. We also had some amazing meals at the house. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And um, yeah, we just, it was a lot of relaxing and napping and surprise naps. Yes, so many surprise naps. I had naps. quite a few surprise naps where yes. I had no intention of napping, and then I woke up a couple hours later and went, oh, I guess I napped. Yep, yep, yep. Um, There were quite a few of those. Yeah. We did take a couple pictures. I did take a couple videos, but nothing like... Nothing major. Nothing major, nothing so great that it's like, oh, man, you have to see this. We did get to go see the big water. Yes, there was big water. We saw it. We um, took pictures. I yep. got to put my feet in. It was very nice. Yes, it was chilly, not. but nice. It was very nice. We saw some Krabby Krabs. We saw some crabby crabs. We were very, we were a little disappointed that there weren't crabs around our house because yeah. typically we, we like, like to watch them because mm. we were back a little further than usual. But when we went for the walk to the beach, we got to see some crabs. Saw so that was fun. Crabby crabs. Yeah. We did not catch any crabs. No. Of any variety. No. We did not eat any crabs either because yeah. gross. Ew. Yeah. yeah. That's another thing. Neither one of us are seafood people. So. Yeah. So we go to the beach where everything's like. Fresh seafood, yeah. and we're like, uh, no, but like, fuck yeah, seafood. And we're like, yeah, where's the burgers? Give us burgers and steak, which we Thanks. ate. I, I ate a phenomenal burger that was really good bacon goo one or whatever it was, the bacon jam one, yeah, bacon uh -huh. jam. Yeah, I yeah, know bacon jam ones. And they're like, it's jam made out of bacon. I was like, fuck yeah, that sounds great. Let's, it looked let's pretty make good. That happened. We and did ate, get to eat at Hardee's, and you ate a life, life changing pork chop. This pork chop. My sister's like, it's life changing. You have to eat it. And I'm like, it's pork chop. Like, how life changing can a pork chop be? It was a really stinking good pork mm -hmm. chop. It I was like her, a was like... huge pork chop and it was stuffed with Gouda stuffing. Oh my God, it was so good. And she got this pork chop and it was sitting in front of her. And I was like, all right, we need to pause right here because right now, this part of your life is pre pork chop. And everything after this moment of your life is going to be post pork chop because this is a life changing pork chop. It was. It was. 
So now we're living in the post pork chop. We're living timeline. in post pork chop timeline. <laughs> so it it was very good though. Yeah, good. Again, he did get to go to Hardee's. Um, he did go to Hardee's on the way twice. down and the way back. Yes, those are on some the way down. We phenomenal burgers too. I eat so much burgers. He eats so many burgers. He also Burger had a Five tactic. Guys burger. I did down there. That was an expensive burger. Was it good though? It was good. Okay. It wasn't phenomenal. It was no. It was. Oh. I mean, it was a good Five Guys burger. Sure. Yeah, so anything like bacon jam on it. We went to Hardy's for lunch on the way down, and then on the it's way like, back, it's like I have a big baby here. I know it's really sweet. It's just big tan. On baby. the way back, we did not follow my parents back. They had to leave pretty early, so we we're left like, about no, an hour and a half later. Or so they're so like, "We're gonna have a five. We're like, "We're not." We're like, we're like "No, that's we're not gonna not. happen." We went back on our own, and we stopped at Hardy's for lunch. And it, we made really good time we on the way back. We made really good time. Because she sped like crazy. Me. She was driving so fast. It was, cr- it was just zoom. No, we did spend most of the time on 95 though. Like not most of the time, but we spent time. a good I, portion of the time. I think we spent more time on 64 or whatever. Yeah, whatever it was. But we... But the secret, the secret is um, we put our accent on after Hardy's. We stopped for lunch. We didn't. I didn't because we stopped, I don't have an accent. We stopped for lunch and then we had our lunch and then we got in. And she drove up to lunch and then it yeah. was my turn to drive after lunch. So then we got in. And then we were, we were rushing the rest of the way home. Yep, he was. Rushing very quickly. And that was the secret. We got home very quickly because I was Russian. Russian home. Russian right? home. It sounds different when I'm not yelling. Oh, there was so much yelling. I don't know what you're talking about. And there about. were so many animal noises on the way down. I don't still don't know what you're I'm pretty sure I have a video of that somewhere. No, no clue. Uh, it's hard What's to have a video. Doing? Oh, he didn't he, like... He's trying to brace over here and get mm-hmm. something. What are you doing, buddy? How can I make this work better? Oh, no. Nope, oh, nope, you nope, messed nope. everything up now. Hold on. No, no, no. There. Okay, you're good. You're good. You're good. Put the ears forwards. You're good. Oh, he's upset now. Mm, he's always a little upset. He wasn't earlier. He was on, pretty happy. Get it figured out. You're, you're, I, I spilled my cat. So we don't actually have a whole lot to like. We really didn't do much. We really. We really didn't. Really do much. didn't do much. Like the more I think about it, the less we did. It's weird because like we didn't even we didn't go out for like a, a nice dinner like we usually do. We didn't go Just on like the a two date of us. night. Yeah, we because yeah. we normally go on like a date night and we didn't go on a shopping trip. We didn't do shopping. We didn't go on a date night. Now we, y'all went um down. Oh, I got my nails did. Yeah, exactly. Y'all went down on um, that one day where the fam ate and then you yes. and Shay had the sister yes. day. And y'all got your nails done and everything. And I stayed my ass at home and flopped around in a hot tub. Yes, he in did. In my Speedos. What? I love that. They are called. They are the Speedos brand. But I love that you say that because you know everybody's going to be thinking like Speedos. They were Speedos. They were Speedos. I'm pretty sure that's why I bought them, because they were blue and they were Speedos. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. But they're swim trunks. They're, they're Speedos. They're Speedo swim trunks. Yep. But we did take Wooden Boy, as usual. Now, I don't know. Have we discussed Wooden Boy? No, I don't before? believe we have. The, this trip is uh, kind of a family thing. It's been going on for a while. Mm-hmm. Well, I guess over a decade, because Andrew's been in California almost a decade. Really? That long? Yep. No. Yep. So Andrew used to go with us. Back in the day, Mm -hmm. before he moved to California. And then the first year after he moved to California, he couldn't go with us. We printed out a picture of his face, glued it to a board, and drew a stick figure body underneath it. And it's Wooden Boy. And we took him on the vacation. And there were so many. Wooden Boy on a floaty in the pool. Wooden Boy in the hot tub. Wooden Boy everywhere. Just everywhere. We had a... A little, like a small single bed in that house. Wooden boy, and yeah. wooden boy wooden was boy put to sleep. He, he had a high chair yep, in the yep, kitchen yep. that he ate with us. We went all out on it. We went all out, took pictures so of much. everything and sent it to him to let him know that he was included in the family vacation. And he's, wooden boy is still kicking. And I had even... Same picture. I had printed out several pictures that year. Yeah, we had printed well, out like 10 just in case. Never replaced it. It's still the same picture, same original picture, same but original he is still picture. kicking and he went with us and uh, he he joined me at the hot tub. Yep. And uh, yep. yeah, Wooden Boy is, is good times. He's he's probably upstairs in the bedroom. Probably. He usually yeah, lives in our he bedroom. Lives in our bedroom because trauma. Yeah. But yeah, Wooden Boy went with us again. Mm-hmm. Wooden Boy and the Serious Hat. Those are the staples of the beach vacation. Wooden Boy and Serious Hat. Yeah. But yeah, Wooden Boy went with us. He joined me in the hot tub while everybody... Because I had the whole beach house to myself. Because mm-hmm. uh, 
the other couple was off doing something yeah. that day, and then you y'all were off doing your thing, and I had a whole beach house to myself, and I flopped around in the. I I I gambled because I had my um, wireless headphones, mm. which are sport buds, so they're supposed to be water resistant. And I was like, "How water resistant are they? Can I can I wear these in a hot tub and they will not die?" And to mm-hmm. me, the gamble was worth it to be able to like sit in a hot tub and listen to my music and just relax in the hot tub with my music. The gamble was worth it. If they would have broken, then it would have been worth it to listen. But they didn't. They They're didn't still break. working, so You're it was all good. Up? But yeah, just chilling in the hot tub with hot the music. Dub. The hot tub. Come on, I got some head scratches for you. Yeah. Now I have a bumps. Now he's testing your microphone. Anyway, where were we? Uh, headphones in the hot tub. Yes. Probably gonna have to take a couch nap later just to make up to Gizzard a little bit. Oh, it wasn't close enough to me. It, it usually isn't. So, good job, Bob. You always tell me I don't want it like right in my face. Well, you want it at a forty-five degree angle over here, but you always do this. Me, me, me. I try to tell you and you just go He time. found a chair that he loved Oh man, I found two chairs that I loved And nobody would help me steal them No, Everybody said they would help me steal them But whenever it came to actually loading them in vehicles Nope But it was just, I mean, one was just a leather recliner thingy One was like the new style That's like got the wooden base and stuff mm-hmm. It's like weird Just super comfy, I lived there Took the Steam Deck and the Miu Mini, both of the portable gaming systems, and mm-hmm. just kind of set up on that chair over by the window and just yep. played games the entire time. That was my thing. When I needed to find him, I looked. Looked at that chair. Looked at that chair, and ninety nine percent of the time, that's where he was. And it was a leather chair, so if you didn't, you didn't have to look for me. Just had to listen. And I'd scratch, and that's scratch, true. Scratch, scratch. That's true. So and then there was another chair right outside our bedroom on that floor, that rocking one. Mm, that, was pretty, that one was pretty comfortable. Yeah. Not as comfortable, but it was pretty comfortable. It was pretty comfortable. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But it was pretty great. The house had all of those. Um, whenever we go, there's always some little amenities that are off. Yes. Sometimes it's like the 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 shower head is too low, or the water pressure isn't great. Something. There's always a little. The the Wi-Fi is spotty mm-hmm. all week. Something. Yeah. Something. Um, all the amenities were were like. Mm. On point this time. We're great this time. Yeah, all the there was no little annoyances whatsoever nope. the entire week. So that was that the was the shower great. was wonderful. The shower it was, was the great. best shower we've had while we've yeah. been down there. Good pressure and nice and high. Yeah, I didn't have to duck to no, wash it was anything. Really nice. It was really nice. Because I have problems with shower heads because I'm like six one. So being six one, living in a world of five ten, my life is hard. Is what I'm saying. Poor baby, super hard. Um. Yeah. So we really don't have anything. To really, truly fill you in on with the vacation other than what we just said. Mini golf and go-karts. Mini golf and go-karts were the the fun activities. I mean, we did other fun things like napping. My sister was supposed to teach me how to crochet and we didn't. That's not her we, fault No, we, I said we didn't. Somebody decided they were going to restart their Animal Crossing yeah. Island again. So I restarted my Animal Crossing Island again. and Unlike the second day. And then, so I was playing that for a little bit, but then every time I felt like crocheting, she was either home or like, I thought we were going to learn the last night we were there, but then she was just really, really tired. And the one night she was hung over. So it just, it kind of like, you should have it just never sort of worked out. We should have, and we didn't. And that's, that is more my fault than hers, but I'll learn eventually. I bought, <laughs> we went to a yarn store and I spent a whole lot of money on skeins, skeins of yarn and scarns. 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 I got three things, three balls of yarn, a really pretty crochet hook that I probably already have that size here, but it's a really pretty wooden one. It's very, very nice. You're very, very nice. I haven't used it, haven't opened it, you know, eh, whatever. It's fine. I'll figure it out. I know enough people that know how to crochet. I just need to find a time to have one of them teach me. I'm having an off day today. I had a dream last night that Casper was there and she was wandering around and she would let me pet her, but she wouldn't let me snuggle her or pick her up. She kept hiding from me and it made me really, really sad. So then I woke up and now I'm just sad about kitties because I feel like they're not loving me enough. I don't feel loved enough by my kitties today. They're a bunch of jerks, so that makes sense. Like Finnegan cuddled with you and not me. Gizzard hasn't even said good morning to me yet. You know, like Bubs jumps up stands for five seconds and then goes right back to you i just i'm having a sad kitty day very sad kitty day so yeah on our one outing that we went on 
she uh, slathered her ginger up in 100 SPF I did. sunscreen and took him outside in the sunshine. Mm -hmm. um, I did manage to burn my neck. A little bit, not too, it. too bad. Not too bad, but still, 100 yeah. SPF, and I managed to burn 100 through. SPF, and he managed yeah. to burn through in like two hours. Yeah. I don't know how. So it was, was kind of neat. Well, the go-karts, there was nobody around for the go-karts. No, there was nobody. no one. That's kind of the nice thing about going off-season, because nothing's super packed. So we just like went in, go-karts, ran. It was, it was all right. The go-karts were fun, but mm -hmm. every time I do go-karts, they're over too early. Yeah. They're over too quick. And I'm... So outside, out, out just out of high school, I worked at uh, a local go-kart track for two summers. Kind of got my feel on go-karts then. So it's fun, but it's not like, yeah, because I drove a lot of dope. I was more scared yeah. because I'm not used to doing things like that. So then when I finally started getting in my groove, it was time to quit. Yep. So I'm Every like, time. well, yeah. all right. But then from there, we went over to uh, mini golf, which wasn't the mini golf we were planning on going to. No, the one we had planned on going to was closed for the season. Yeah, so we went to a different one, which was open and was pretty it, good. It was pretty good. It was, it was fun. The one that we ended up going to had um, three courses in it, nine holes each, and we did two of the three we courses. We did two of the three, and everybody... It was, it was so hot. There was no shade. Yeah. There weren't, like, really drink options. Like no, the, it was sunny. It, it was, was sunny, very warm. Day. It was beautiful, but it was everybody was just hot and tired, and we're like, let's just leave, so... It was we only did two. Very different from playing VR mini golf with her brother, which yeah. is what I'm used to. And there were eight of us. Or eight of us, so we split playing up into mini golf. Two groups of so four. we split into two groups of four, and then we kind of one group went, and one group went, and then the other group went, and it was mm -hmm. it was a good time. It was a really good time. It was yeah. a good time. Really, really good time. I won because I'm awesome. You won by one point. I still won. You still won. And you got Literally. two hole-in-ones. I don't know I got to justify it. You won by one point. Still won. You did. You you won. It was very... Mm -hmm. And we were losing badly the mm -hmm. first... Like, after the first nine holes, we were both yeah. losing very badly. And then... I put on my big girl panties. And he pulled up his big girl panties and ass. kicked everybody's butt. And it was pretty awesome. So Boom. It's okay, buddy. Sorry. No books got... We didn't do a lot of the stuff we were going to do. No, I brought two different books with me, plus a book on my Kindle, just in case. There was no reading You know, because in previous years, we've had a lot of reading. Mm -hmm. like, there's been a lot mm -hmm. of reading. And finally, the last day we were there, Friday, I was like, I need to read. So I read like 100 pages of my book, so I felt better. I'm like, well, at least I started a book and have 100 pages in. So I'm probably going to finish that tonight. It's my plan today. Finish my book. Is it? Yeah. My plan is some Baldur's Gate. Yeah, he's very excited. He missed his computer. Yes. Well, I did take the opportunity. Um, I'm going to be sneaky. Go ahead. I did take the opportunity while... Um, what are you doing? Oh, she's going to hate that. Oh, she's going to hate that. Meow. Bye. Thanks for visiting. But yeah, I took the opportunity... To kind of sit down with some games that I've never managed to get into and kind of like try to get into mm -hmm. them. Like, so I got Andrew, one of Andrew's favorite games is Hollow Knight, like all time. It's like a Metroidvania. And I usually like Metroidvanias, but for some reason, it just never gisted with me. And then I sat down for quite a while the one day. You did. I got it. I finally like started clicking. Like, oh, do you like it? Sense. Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. Stuff started making sense. I started kind of figuring out what I was supposed to do because it's not one of those. It doesn't really tell you what you're supposed to do. It just kind of dumps you in and off mm -hmm. you go. Mm -hmm. um, I'm sorry. I I still don't love the controls. They feel really floaty, and I'm not a fan of them so much. But yeah, I'm starting to like it. That was one that I started getting into. A lot of Chrono Trigger. Trying to get through Chrono Trigger. Yeah. Um, quite a bit of Legend of Zelda: Link to the Past. Art of Rally. I got into the B series of Art of Rally. Everything got much faster and started feeling like, yes, this is what I was looking for for a rally <laughs> game. Fast and ridiculous. Yeah. So, yeah, it was, like, it was, a, it was some good good portable gaming this week, I got to say. I was a little surprised at how much more use the Mi U Mini got over the Yeah, I was surprised Steam too, deck. actually. Yeah. I only played Animal Crossing. You only ever play Animal Crossing. Yeah, I do. But you were taking that. You are taking Yoshi? Yeah, I took Yoshi with me. I didn't use it, but yeah. I Yoshi's, did. Which one is that? Yoshi's Yoshi's Yarn World, I think. Something like that. Yeah, yeah. something like Yoshi's that. Yoshi's Crafted World. Yoshi's, Maybe it's Crafted World. Yoshi's Dino Yarn. Yeah, I don't know. Dino what? Dino Yarn. Yeah, I don't. I don't, I don't know. know. The but, Yoshi Yarn one. Yeah, and I um I I still haven't played it. I don't know. I we bought that one. We bought the. I think sessions. I want to play games, and then like 
I go to Animal Crossing and then you, I get bored with Animal Crossing. And um, You only like familiarity. You don't like new stuff. True. So you don't like figuring out new games. Yep. Very true. And if you can just get over that hurdle of learning the new game, you'd probably yeah. like a lot of games. But probably. Just, that's the hurdle that stops you. So yeah, we got back in yesterday. Um, yesterday afternoon, I while we were traveling back, I ordered the groceries for pickup mm-hmm. for the evening. So that was wonderful. Like that's done. Yep. Don't have to go anywhere if we don't want to. Got everything put away last night. Missed that couch. Oh, the couch is so comfortable. Sure did miss that couch. The couch is so comfortable. We did all the things, you know, we laid on a couch for a little bit, got showers in our own showers, mm, used so our nice. own bathrooms, so nice. fresh sheets on the bed, and then curled up in our bed. It was all that stuff, you know, all that good stuff. Like, oh, yes, I missed this. I didn't realize how much I missed mm-hmm. this. Yeah, it was really nice. It was, but it was, it was also, nice. it was uh, low 70s when we left yesterday morning, and it was low 50s when we got up here. Not low 50s. Not when we got here. And we immediately started arguing about temperature as soon as we got back up here. I mean, like we were fine all week. The house was set to, the, the house was 72 all week. We get up here, this house is 70, and she's upset that it's too warm. It was warm. It's not even 70. It's set to 70, but it's like 68 in here because I checked out the thermostats. It was nice when we walked in and he immediately turned the furnace on and I was very bummed out. Immediately started arguing about temperature. Yeah. But not arguing. We don't argue about temperature. You're just wrong. But yeah, 30, 30 degree temperature drop. Yeah, that wasn't fun. Not my favorite. And it rained a lot. It was a very overcast, rainy, yucky day the whole way home. No, just halfway. My drive. Yeah, just just. And then he got here. beautiful, like... Well, it was nice down there. It was nice down there until about Virginia. In Virginia, we hit rain. Virginia, like I hit rain. And then an hour, it was rain for like two hours. Something like that. And then... Then we stopped for lunch... And then it was kind of like overcast, but not raining. And then we got into the other states Mm -hmm. and it was like, oh, here, let me be beautiful. And it was apparently nice up here last week. So usually when we come back from this trip, all the trees are changing or have changed, Mm -hmm. but they're just starting still. So this week they'll probably get hit because this week's supposed to be like 50s. Yeah, this week's supposed to be 50s. And yeah, yep, we're back. We are. We're back. We left. We were gone. We didn't do much. No. We didn't take a lot of pictures because we didn't do much. No. Nope. I'd show you pictures of us napping. Is that, that's not what I mean. We didn't take any pictures of us napping anyway. That's not what I mean. But it was, it was so many surprise naps. It's just like, I'm going to go down, like lay on the bed and just call oh, asleep. Well, like I went downstairs the one time. I, I told my mom I was sitting upstairs. So there was this little like nook. Yeah. Right off of the like, dining room. Like there was like three together. steps and then you just sat up there and they had four chairs and a big like table. By table, I mean like a coffee, like table. A coffee table. It was the cutest little nook ever. So that was where mom and I spent most of the week. Because it was up in the sun and your mom could sit in the windows. And mom could sit herself. in the window and sun herself. Like and mine was a window. little far back and yeah, like gizzard. Mom and gizzard are a lot alike. Yeah. And I kind of sat back where I was still like there was, it was sunny and bright, but I wasn't super hot in the air conditioner. There was a vent near me. So I was kind of cool. It was, it was nice. That was where mom and I spent most of our vacation when I wasn't napping. I was up there with her and I was like, all right, I'm going to go down and get my book and then I'll be right back up. She's like, okay. And I went downstairs and you followed me down and cause he didn't know why I was going down. So he's like, what are you doing girlfriend? Cause I was my, they had the nook up there and my chair was on the complete opposite side of the house. From yeah. Where they were so at. he didn't know what I was doing. So yeah. he was like, it was right above the stairway. Yes. So he could so. watch me go down. So he came around and he came down and he was like, what are you doing girlfriend? I'm like, Oh, I'm just grabbing my book. He's like, Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. And then he laid on the bed and he like, curled himself up and I went what are you doing and he goes nothing just laying here for a minute just laying and I'm like oh and then I sat down beside him and I was like are you gonna take a nap no and two hours later and then two hours later we woke up we woke up and I walked upstairs and mom went did you find your book (laughs) well I found a surprise nap and I didn't bring my book up (laughs) and I decided I didn't want to read after all and then I just scrolled on tiktok that was the groggy day after. That was the, mm. that, that made us groggy. That was the the biggest yeah. surprise nap was the one that made us the groggiest yeah. for sure. The first day had back to back naps. Like we woke up and we took a nap. We woke up. We woke had up. Had some coffee. Had some breakfast. Took a nap. Woke up. Had some lunch. Went back out. Took another nap. Woke up. Had some dinner. Went to bed. Yeah, that first day we needed we we got some sleep in. There was so much. We must have needed it. Else we wouldn't have been able to. That's how I look. Well, at it. I had trouble sleeping that night. I didn't. <laughs> I had trouble sleeping that night and was up for a couple of hours laying in bed. But even then, it was like, 
it was relaxing because mm. like we were in a new place. I did you when you woke up in the middle of the night last night, were you confused? No. I was. Like I woke up in the middle of the night and went, Why isn't the nightlight on? Mm. It wasn't a nightlight, but we had we had a bathroom to ourselves off of our bedroom at the beach. We always had a light on in there so we could find it. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, why isn't the light on? Oh yeah, we're home. And then I was fell back to sleep. But <laughs> Yeah, no, I wasn't confused when I woke up. That was good. It was very good. It was very nice. It was very yeah. relaxing. It yeah. was very it was it obviously was much needed. We obviously oh, needed yeah. all those naps and just rest because we both have headaches today though. But I think it's just Let's elevation changes and yeah. stuff. I can I'm stuffed up. I can hear it. I can yeah. hear it that I'm stuffed up and I can feel it. That's always one nice thing about being down to the beach is I usually I usually don't have the big head stuffs like I have up here. My nose I have the nose stuffs, but my sinuses mm. aren't bad. Now we're back up here, my sinuses are all yeah. again. Um I don't know how much of that is the elevation and how much of that is just kitties. Yeah. But I'm proud of myself. I didn't drink much. Not that it matters. I don't drink much to begin with, but usually I go hard on beach trips. At least with my sister, we usually have one evening where we get like. There wasn't drunk. a lot of. There wasn't a whole lot. There of wasn't much drinking the whole week, other than coffee. There was a lot of coffee. But there also, I didn't have a whole lot of water, so I think I was really dehydrated mm. all week. So I'm drinking my thirty ounces of water and actually looking at the website to see about getting either another one of these or a forty ouncer, because I think my goal for the rest of the year is to drink it at least. I know they say, I swear that the amount that they tell you you should drink, like half of your body weight in water or something, that's too, that's too much water. I feel like that can't be good. Or like a gallon of water or however many ounces, like 64 ounces or something. I've been told that if, as long as you're not thirsty, but you don't get thirsty, you're weird. So, but I figure 30 ounces of water a day is better than no water a yeah, day. Absolutely. Yeah. So I'm going we're, to we're take another hiatus off of uh Yeah. Red Bull I'm and taking sodas. another hiatus off of Red Bull and sodas again because mm-hmm. what, since I got back from my big vacation for my birthday and I had let myself start having sodas occasionally, I haven't liked the taste of them. I'd have like a sip and be like, yeah, no, and then I wouldn't drink it. They're starting to taste good again. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, nope, I can't have this. Mm-hmm. I don't want to crave it. I don't want to I don't want it. And then you started. You and started. they make me feel crappy when I drink them. Like they don't, I don't feel hydrated. I don't feel good. I just feel weird. Like I can't explain it. I don't like it. I'm like, okay, I'm done. And Red Bull never stopped tasting good. And, then and you, you started with letting yourself have one like once a week. Then I was letting myself have one once a week. And then it was becoming more than that because my boss at work really likes Red Bull. So we were buying each other Red Bull like every day. So for like la- the week before I went on vacation, I had probably, I had one day where I didn't have a Red Bull. And then we were on vacation and I bought a four pack of Red Bull. It's so good. But I, and oh, and then I went out drinking the night before we left and I had a Red Bull and I went drinking the Friday before that, celebrating with a friend and I would drink Red Bull and vodka. So I just, I need to, I need to step back and not, Mm-hmm. not drink soda and Red Bull again because it definitely I feel better physically when I'm not mm-hmm. but yeah so I'm gonna stop I, I need more hold water. me accountable I need more water more I need water. to start drinking less carbonated crap 30 ounce yeah just less carbonated crap but 30 I mean, ounces of water a day if not more like, more is better but at least 30 ounces and I everywhere like, I read says that you should drink before you drink your coffee in the morning you should drink a big glass of water first because it's better for you well, every place you read that can fuck right off because I ain't nobody got time for that. Yeah, I was trying to think if I could do that. I probably Big can't. Big glass of water before. No. They say because coffee dehydrates you and you're already dehydrated from sleeping. So drinking the water helps to rehydrate you and then you can drink your coffee. It I makes will, sense. I'll tell you, though, because most of this week I was drinking warm waters because they just they got that case of water and just sat on the counter. They were, they were all in the fridge, though. Like they had water in the fridge. It was just like, you know, off the shelf bottled spring water and everything mm-hmm. and then we got back and i grabbed my frosty cold glass bottle of yum bespoke culligan water i mean i chugged half that bottle because it was so delicious it was, it was very yum it was so delicious, it was, it was so delicious. You, you don't even know girlfriend it was so yum 
I still don't like regular water. I have to buy the hint water Weird or enough. something. Have you tried it? So I can. I actually. It's cold, but it's cold as good. So young. I if I mix like a bottle of hint and then put that in like the rest, I can do that. Have you tried mixing this just with your mouth? No. I mean, yes, and it's gross. Hi, guys. On the way down at Hardy's, I bit my fucking tongue. Ooh, yeah, it was bad. So hard. That shit hurt until Wednesday. Yeah, it was it bad. Was ba- I was like, that was so bad. Oh, and I just bit at the exact same spot, which is what made me think about it. When? Just now. Oh. Not nearly as hard. I don't think it's going to hurt for like four days, but. I'm going to get a gizzard, I think. Oh, you little bitch. I don't know why you don't get a gizzard. I have no idea. <laughs> uh oh. You're going to get a gizzard. See, none of the cats like me. All right. What are you doing? Ow, you're stepping on headphone wires. Ow. <laughs> She's off. Those little green. Oh, those green eyes. She's a girl. Boy, the sun just came out hard. It was all overcast this morning. The sun did just come out, finally. Super hard. I forgot we had it was like, sun! a sun here. Yeah, because we woke up at like 8.30. I felt like it was like 6.30 because it was like all dark and me. Yeah, and I was, was like, why is it so dark? It was pretty dark. Boop. But yeah, sun is out now. Yes, the sun is out now, and it's. Do we have any plans for the day? No. No. Nope. Good. You're gonna play Baldur's Gate? Quite possibly. I have a couple TV shows I want. Well, I have Love Is Blind. I want to catch up on. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I don't actually know if I will though, but. Well, um... A lazy day. We have lunch because we saved some of our leftovers from dinner last night yes. for lunch today. I got a I got a really cheese steak. Yep. And what did you get? Chicken wrap. I have a buffalo chicken wrap, yeah. half of a buffalo chicken wrap to eat. So yeah, yeah, we have lunch that. already yeah. ready, and we done had breakfast already. We already had breakfast. I fed him I breakfast. Plan for everything, and then you're you, what well, you're making, you're making soup for dinner. Right? I'm making soup for dinner for mm-hmm. me, and you're either gonna have hamburger helper or uh, not so sloppy joes, whichever mm-hmm. you prefer. Mm-hmm. So you get to decide. You get a choice. Eat some dinner. Probably you'll play more video games and I will catch up on some YouTube videos that I didn't watch. And then, no, I'm not going to catch up on YouTube. I'm going to read. Read. going to read a book. You're not going to read YouTube comments. No, 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 no. no. Back to the everything tomorrow. Back to the everything tomorrow. Mm -hmm. This was always, we always prefer going Saturday to Saturday whenever we go to the beach. So we have Sunday to just kind of like ease back into everything and yeah because we got all the laundry and everything done yesterday which was nice all we got back done. so early yesterday that we were able to get a lot of that done which was awesome we got unpacked got all the laundry done today is more just kind of easing back into life again like real life getting used to kitties again getting used to having the kitties again she's trying to figure out how to be crash landed properly behind mm-hmm. you mm-hmm. very stinky she's not stinky it's very stinky can you smell her so it was really weird because we were talking about it a little bit this morning because usually we go on vacation, we come back, and once we get back and start getting into routine again, the vacation feels like it was kind of surreal, like, you know, like it was almost a dream or something. But we both said this time, whenever we got back, this is the part that feels yeah. weird. This is the part that doesn't feel quite right. I don't know what's causing that. Well, I think, I mean, I don't know for sure, but I feel like part of it, so when we were on vacation... We went to bed early-ish every night, and we were up by, like, 7 o'clock every morning. Mm -hmm. So you're up by 7 o'clock every morning. We'd get up. The sun was out. Like, it had just been rising. It was pretty out. It was, like, it felt like a morning. You know what I mean? Like, your typical morning, like, the sun is out. People are outside walking around. It's just, you know, like had our coffee, sat in the sunshine up in the nook, because you drank your coffee Mm -hmm. up in the nook with us. And then we wake up this morning at like 8, which is already an hour, we're already an hour off. It's like overcast. And it's an overcast, dreary day. Mm -hmm. There's no sunshine. Mm -hmm. We come down, we get our coffee, we go and we sit in our dark living room. Mm -hmm. And it's just like, there was no sunshine, there was no... Like it just, it seemed surreal because we had a week of Maybe. sunshine and early morning and quiet mm-hmm. also. And then we get here and there's kitties crying and overcast dreary day, no sunshine, sit in a dark 
living room. Like it, it might, was just. That might be a big part because uh, even you know the couple days before we left to go down, it was sunny and nice. It was out sunny there. and nice out. I really think it was just there was no sun there. and it was just cold. Yeah, cold. yeah. Like was, we woke up and it was cold. Like it was seventies. Like I would I would say like between seventy and seventy three, seventy four every morning when we got up. But still, it was like in the seventies there was sunshine. We get here, it's like yeah. 45. That probably has to have a lot to do with it. Overcast, no yeah. sun. And we just slotted everything back in so quick last night. Yeah. So that might, yeah. It just didn't seem like it was. There's a little, this little shithead. But we is back. Turn that into a drinking game. Every time we say we is back, take a shot. See if you make it this far. Well, they wouldn't know about it until right now. You gonna cut Go that out? And put it at the beginning. Go hey, back in time. Go back Rewatch in time. now. Rewatch now. Get our view counted up. Go, go, go. Go, go, dude. I'm still, I'm still tired. I feel like I was not ready to get up at eight o'clock. I was, I, was, I, I wanted to continue sleeping. I was very tired, and we, we got more sleep last night than we have. Oh, I slept like a log last night. It's crazy. I was gonna say we got more sleep last night than we have, but that's not true because we napped most of the week. Yeah. But. Well, uh, like, an average night, in an average in an average night, we got more sleep nap. last night than we did the yeah. entire trip. And nobody woke us up this morning. Mm-mm. Finnegan was outside the door, but he wasn't making any noises. Nope, he was waiting patiently. Uh, everybody seemed to be good. Nobody seemed too upset. Everybody, everybody's good. So thanks to my sister for yes, thank you care so of much for taking care of everybody. You did such a phenomenal job, and mm. we're so thankful and appreciative. No, we have heard zero complaints. Zero complaints from any mm. of the kitties or the fish. Very much appreciated. Very much appreciated. Thank you so much. And the big tank downstairs is still looking good because we, we tried to. I don't know. We didn't talk about that either because we tried to. We tried to do a quick water change on the downstairs tank. That's a hundred and fifty gallon before we left mm. and realized that the filter was like 80 percent clogged yeah it was really bad so it turned into an emergency filter cleaning emergency was filter cleaning we did a much bigger water change gross. than we had meant to it was it was something that was supposed to take like an hour ended up like taking three. like three it right. was very gross very long but they look phenomenal they look so good and uh, they look so good that was needed yeah, totally. I totally. Yeah, that was not great. And then the upstairs tank is still just the two little guys and a whole two bunch little of guys and a whole bunch snails. of gross snails. So we need to we need to go find assassin snails. An assassin snail, maybe a betta or something. I don't know. I think I would like a betta. I was gonna yeah. say about the kissy fish, but I think a betta would be more fun. Mm-hmm. I want to keep because the kissers ended up getting fairly big. Yeah. No, I'd like to stay. stay small. I think a betta would be mm-hmm. nice for that tank. Yep, and yep, then yep. Finny would have a fish to watch. Mm-hmm. Because he tries to watch the... Yeah, they don't do anything. But they don't come out. They're like us on vacation. All they do is nap. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Kitties would love vacation. They would. Because they would have just napped the whole time. Which but is probably they what they did. Oh, we, there sure. was There was... Uh, that chair was totally covered in, in fur. Mm-hmm. Uh, my spot on the couch was totally covered in fur. The pillow over by the window was totally covered in fur so they had their spots and the bottom of our bed was covered in fur bottom of the bed was covered in fur and the blanket the mm, big blanket the was big covered blanket on the couch so they definitely had they definitely had their spots while we were gone and yeah. they curled up and stayed at so they probably spent most of the time sleeping on my shoulder gizzard mm, it's your shoulder gizzard your shoulder cat i got a pirate mug that isn't mine it is yours how did i don't even know how we got that so the other couple that went with us, they went out on a date night and they went out to dinner at the place that we had gone to dinner okay. on our last date night. Uh-huh. And that's the only place around that has like souvenir cups if you get like certain drinks. So they had gotten a, one of them, I don't know which one, had gotten a drink that came in a souvenir mug and it was like a pirate cup. While they had been out shopping previously, they had gotten my mom... Uh, like reusable straws because my mom is very into like being eco-friendly and using straws. She's a hippie. Yeah. And she, she will admit it. She's a hippie. And has always been a hippie. They got my dad like flavored it's like strawberry I don't know. They got him like vinegar but not vinegar. I don't, I don't remember what it's called but they got him something. Something to cook with. So. Vinaigrette? Yes. It was like a strawberry vinaigrette or something. Mm. Something like that. So they're like oh we'll just give Cora the cup. 
So they brought it up and gave it to me. And I'm like, oh, thanks, guys. And then Aaron came up and went, oh, mine. I and sure did. I lost my cup. Yeah. It's got it's got a pirate on one side and it's got the skull and crossbones on the other it's side. It's cool. like, this is mine. It is pretty cool. Like, where did this come from and why is it mine now? And I told them, I'm like, well, Aaron stole my present. And they're like, well, I mean. He had to come, he had to go. It's going to the same yeah. house. That's fine. You still can look at it. I'm like, yeah. all right, thank you. It was good. We really, we didn't buy any souvenirs. No, we didn't go to any of the souvenir shops. We didn't, we didn't go shopping at all. Did you notice though that this year, every year we go down, we always go off season. Every year we go down, all of the souvenir shops have like 50% off sales. Mm -hmm. This is the first year they did not. I asked my sister about it and she said that like normally all of the, everything's kind of shutting down now. Like they're slowly starting to shut down just because they're not very busy anymore. Like there's not a... Mm -hmm. A surplus of people, but she said this year people have just been flocking. Like they it had some of their surprisingly still busy busiest day. Like there were people on the beach. We never go and look at the beach, and there's like you might see one or two people. There were like families on the mm -hmm. beach still. Like it was. So she said that they're probably not even going to do those sales anymore because so many people are coming in. They don't have to try to get yeah. rid of inventory. Yeah, yeah, it was definitely there's definitely more people than we usually, and we uh, more people than usual, and we were. This is one of the later times mm -hmm. that we've gone down yeah. here. Usually, it's middle to end of September. I think this is the first time we've gone down in October. No, we're usually gone the first weekend of October because when I helped your sister out with, mm -hmm. usually we're getting back the first week, like the that Saturday. Yeah. So yeah. I can't help your sister until the Sunday. Yeah, yeah. It. I don't know. It was. It was really busy and it wasn't no, it wasn't, it wasn't really, really busy. It was really but busy. It was for really busy for the time of year yeah. that it was. It was very strange yeah. that there were that many people. Because my sister and her boyfriend both work in restaurants and they both said that they're like amazed at how many people mm -hmm. they still have coming in now. Like normally they're like dead at this point. And they still have like like the one restaurant had like a three hour wait the one night for dinner. Mm -hmm. That's crazy for off season. Super cray, super gray. But yeah, uh, we didn't do much. I thought I thought this would be. We're back. I, I thought we would have so <laughs> much to back. talk about. Yeah, I thought we were gonna have so much. To, I thought we were gonna we almost have to make this like two episodes, because normally we're, you know we yeah. go and do things do stuff, and do this, do you know that. oh yeah. we did this we went here we went to this bookstore we went to shopping here we did this, and this year it was nothing. just very laid back. Usually we always end up going to like a grocery store every single day because like there's something you forget or something you decide you want. We didn't even do that. I didn't. We got down there. We went to the store that day, picked up a couple of things mm -hmm. that we'd forgotten. I didn't leave the house for like the next three days. You didn't. Like I did. All. I went like because I did the one day with my sister for my nails. Mm -hmm. I went with um, I think I went to the store the one time mm -hmm. I got to meet my sister's new pup. Mm -hmm. That was fun. She's real cute. But yeah, it was good. It just wasn't very exciting. Um, it's uh, terrible for um, content. It was It was a wonderful vacation. Mm -hmm. We really enjoyed it. It's yeah. just terrible for content and it's conversation. Not at all. Because we napped. Yeah. We had some lots of naps, lots of video games. Excellent really naps, good nap. Excellent video games. Yeah. But, yeah. Excellent coffee. I thought the coffee was, was really good. Was I had okay an amazing coffee, coffee mug. Yeah. We found really yes. good. Yes. Every house we go to, we always kind of like find our coffee mug for the mm -hmm. week. And we both found some really good coffee mugs for the week. Yeah. So that was pleasant. And we left them. We didn't steal the coffee mug. Either. No, we didn't take the coffee mug. You, were, you did not allow, allow me to steal anything. There were no crimes. No crimes. I was very disappointed. No crimes the entire week. Very disappointed. I was really looking forward to some crimes. Well, next yeah. time. Next time. Next we'll time save we'll all the crimes, crimes for next yeah. time. Yeah, back into everything tomorrow, back into the things. Tomorrow and I go stuff. back to work and you start back doing your thing. Yep, 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 which I'm we'll gonna... start with editing this. So. Yeah. So. So, all right, yeah, uh, we'll try to... We'll try to be more entertaining next week. Yeah, yeah. We're both uh, still, still really tired and in, like, vacation brain, I think. Yeah, all that, that's a lot of driving. That's that's like, a lot of driving. If you drive straight through, it's like eight hours. I think we did it. We left at like 7 or 7.30. I think we got here at like 3. Mm -hmm. So that was that many hours. Math. That was like 8 hours. Mm -hmm. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 5, 6, 7, 8 hours. 
So yeah, we did pretty good, even with that. And that was, it was like 3.30. Yeah. Because we stopped and had We stopped lunch, like a yeah. half hour for lunch. Yeah. So, I mean, we made really good time. and still a lot of time in the car. And got home, got everything done, and everything. Was we we like, got home, and we were so busy just getting yeah. everything else done that I think we were just so exhausted last night when we went to sleep just because traveling always takes it out of you especially whenever your girlfriend's driving so freaking fast screaming and rushing at everybody it's 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 stressful so weird too because i can't even speak in a russian accent so stressful we'll be back next week we will be back this long for the episode we appreciate you thank you very much sorry if it was kind of if you didn't last this long it's okay i don't know that we would either (laughs) then you are welcome to if you didn't last this long then you probably experienced our vacation and had a nap so yeah good for you you. interactive podcast this week if you didn't or if you did make it this long you deserve a nap go take a nap go take a nap go take a nap nap, because i've made myself tired so I'm Naps probably are delightful. Gonna, probably going to take it out. But this girl. Yeah, he's not referring to me. No. To he's Gizzard. referring to Gizzard. Because she hasn't had any dad naps all week. No. So. Oh, that's what they're going to do. It's going to be adorable. Their naps are so cute. So. Hear a big snore and a little snore. Big snore and a little snore. Sometimes you don't know which one's which. Well, it's hard to say. All right. Well, thanks for stopping by. Thanks so much for stopping by. We'll hit you up next week. Yep. And, and uh, yeah. Have a good week. <laughs>